I'd like to welcome you to Unilever where we are carrying out a water treatment project and the reason is because the client came to us and told us that um, they, they require their water to be treated to a specific requirement and as we all know Unilever is well known for their range of products in the market uh, they give us blue band, they give us royco, they give us lotions and oils and they also give us spreads so for all these processes they need purified water to a particular requirement and they need the permeate water to be at 7,000 litres per hour in order to feed their processing factory and so in brief this particular project entails filtration and reverse osmosis and the reason for this is because they need their TDS levels to be lowered from what it was to a much lower level and reverse osmosis is very good at reducing TDS levels. So what we have is we have a pre-filtration system. After the water is pre-filtered, it enters in through the reverse osmosis system. After the reverse osmosis system, the water comes out through the permeate, which you can be able to actually check through this permeate meter. And from there, it goes into a clean water tank. From the clean water tank, the client is able to pump it all the way to the different factories which are now using this particular water. This particular project entails eight membranes which are in four, pre four pressure vessels and they are connected in series. So water moves from the first pressure vessel into the second and that is the concentrate and the concentrate from the second moves to the third and to the fourth. The recovery we have managed to achieve with this particular system is 72%. So we are feeding in about 9.7 cubic meters of water and getting out 7 cubic meters of water as our permeates. So basically we were doing the installation. This is a 7 cubic arrow system. Now the installation process, first uh, you have to do, you have to set the arrow, as you can see, the arrow and the filter, the chemical tanks, you have first to position them the way the flow will be. So starting from the raw water tank, then we have the pumps, the duty and stand, standby. So we have the filter. We'll, we are going to have another filter just next to this one, which will be having carbon to remove the chlorine. Now from the carbon, the, now we come to the arrow. You do the plumbing itself. Then from now the arrow, we have another plumbing system for the concentrate, which will go to the drain. And now also we have the plumbing system for the permit, which will go to the clean water tank. Building local capacity uh, to design and manufacture water treatment plants of this nature is extremely important for Davis and Shirtliff. We feel it gives us um, an edge over our competitors in the market who many times have to import sophisticated systems that they're unable to, to uh, to support when, when things go wrong. Um, for DNS, uh, by being able to design and build these systems internally, uh, we are able to respond quickly in case uh, things go wrong, in case spare parts are required. That gives us the ability to, to more closely support our customers and keep them satisfied. We are connecting power right now. If you can see my guys, they're just moving. You can see the system is uh, starting to power itself. So we are just almost through. We use the minimum time possible. I, we have done this installation in less than a week.